Hi everyone. Well, I'm currently on the Eurostar. We've just come out of the tunnel into what I can only assume is France. Hello, the Yorkshire countryside zooming past there. As far as I'm concerned, it looks exactly the same as England. I'm just off on my first ever solo holiday, so I thought I'd do one of those video blog things that seem so popular these days. This is partly so I can show all my friends and family all the fantastic places that I've been, but it's also partly so I've got someone to talk to. I've booked a couple of days in Paris and a couple of days in Berlin, so there should be plenty of things for me to see and do, as well as plenty of opportunities to show off just how bad I am at French and German. So, yay! Well, I've just arrived at my hotel, thankfully. A bit of a walk here, because the, uh, the nearest station happened to be closed this week. But on the plus side, getting hopelessly lost has given me a chance to have a bit of a walk around and get to know the area. And as a bit of a bonus, my room has a lovely view of the Eiffel Tower. So at least I know I've got the right city. And just to be absolutely sure it was real, I came in for a closer look. The tower was originally designed as a demonstration of the tensile strength of Meccano. They had planned to take it down after just one year, but unfortunately, they lost the big spanner. Military later debated the use of the tower as a targeting system for a giant planet-destroying laser. But early tests were uninspiring. Well, after a quick sightseeing boat trip and a bite to eat, I'm back in my hotel room. One thing that strikes me as odd is that every single time I try to speak French to someone, they immediately reply in English. Guess I need to uh, work on my accent, huh? 